Hi everybody, welcome to our digital kennel, GermanShepherdMan.com with Star. Wow, this is Shining Star. She's an amazing animal. Her father, world class. Her daddy was V-rated, core class one, Schutzen three, import from Germany. None of that may, may, may mean anything to you, but believe me, he's like, top one percentile of German Shepherds in the world, in my opinion, that type dog. You just don't find that every day. And she's his baby star. What you doing? Hey, darling. And let me tell you, those of you that follow me, you know that star is my super Velcro. I mean, she's like, like this all the time. I have her on a leash, don't need to, but this video is about a, your dog on a leash and what you have to do with your dog. You have to do this. Well, you don't have to do anything, but this is very, very important. And, and I'll tell you why. I had a guy got a puppy for me one time. He had just retired. He was with his dog 24 seven, just all the time he poured his life into this dog. She was very tender and loving and just, they just had this thing. And all of a sudden one day he needed to hand her off for, for a, a some reason he had to hand her off for some to somebody and and be away from her and she just couldn't handle it very well she was a very sensitive very sweet wonderful dog uh, and she got she got so upset digestively it, she got upset so uh, looking at that I'm like huh I need to teach people they need to hand their dog off to somebody else even if you, it, and it's good for you to set the choreographic system, uh, setup up. <laughs> set it up. You know somebody's coming over. You know they're a friend of yours, maybe two or three friends. You're going to say, okay, we're, we're training my, my puppy right now. What I want you to do is I'm going to put her, him on a leash. And when you come over, we'll get through all the greetings and everything. And once they and we kind of settle down, then we're going to walk out on the back deck and I'm gonna hand the leash, my dog, over to you, and you just take them out into the yard, walking away from me, and I'm gonna disappear into the house. Now, according to the personality of the dog, the dog may be, oh, my daddy, my mama, could be like that, or it could be, well, well, okay, all right, I'll go with it, you know? But what I'm trying to say is, there may come a time in life when you have to hand your dog going to the vet. You don't get to just go back and mill all through the vet hospital. You have to hand your dog. Custar, Custar, you have to, they want to see your beautiful face. Come here, come here, come here. Good girl, look at this fabulous animal. Can you come in on that, Jay? Let me take a little side road here. Just just to do what we German Shepherd owners do. Love our babies. Look at that girl. Wow. Wow, okay, I know the sun's in your eyes. Okay, good girl, sorry. Just had to take that side note. You know how we do video, if you follow us, you know how we do videos. We just let the camera roll and what happens, happens. Now, back to handing off, very important choreograph that set that up somebody coming over you know they're coming discuss it with them in advance go out to somebody uh, maybe somebody that you know you're going to meet at at let's say uh, a big box retail store or hardware store or big box pet store whatever you got to go in there and get some things anyway and you know somebody's going to be around have them meet you there in the parking lot and uh you go in, you, you and, and the person and the dog go into the uh, pet store, big, huge pet store. Walk in there, walk around, walk around, everything's calm, everything's cool. And then you hand your dog off to them. You go down one aisle, disappear, they go totally somewhere else. You want your dog to get used to that. Okay? Now, I got my kennel manager, Maddie J. Come, Maddie J. So this is kind of like a setup. Okay, this is how you would say it. Come stand right here and turn to the camera. She hasn't been on any videos much. Maddie, she's wonderful. When she, when she was uh, interviewing here, <laughs> sat down and I said, well, where have you worked? Because she's real young. You know, she's, on, she's only 19 at this recording. And uh, 
She said, well, I worked for Chick-fil-A for blah, blah, blah. I said, you're hired. <laughs> Chick-fil-A employee? Bam! They could take over the world. I mean, they're unbelievable. I don't know if you're Chick-fil-A-ite, but wow, their employees are trained. They are awesome, and they do a fabulous job. And she was one, so, and she's been, I call her my Chick-fil-A girl. She's amazing. She just, I'm bragging on you. She, she's just really, really, really good at what she does here. A great addition to the team. So I'm going to hand this off to her, and you, and you just take her and just go somewhere, and uh, we'll just keep talking. Star, go with her. Uh, 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 go with her. She's looking back at me just a little bit, kind of turning her head a little back. Okay, she settled in and she's going, okay? So, sorry, sounded like a jet might be coming this way and I wanted to, it wasn't a jet. Anyway, just let the camera roll, baby. That's how we roll. <laughs> this is a very important part, especially during your puppy training, especially if you have an older puppy. If you have an older puppy, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 15, uh, 20 months old, if you have an older puppy and they're not really trained, they don't ha really have good manners uh, and they need things like this, you need to get my older puppy training system. I'm not trying to sell you something. I'm just letting you know I built this older puppy training system for you if you're that person. If you have an older puppy, not, not even just German Shepherd, an older puppy, and you need to know how to reel them in, get them under control, get them flowing here in the, on the property, uptown in an urban environment, if you need to get them in, in championship mode, get my older puppy training system. It's, it's really, really good. I, I, I built it for people who didn't really train their, their young puppy or maybe they got an older puppy as a rescue and they don't know what to do and it's kind of like oh out of control big and powerful I'm not trying to tell you something I'm telling you it'll help you a lot get my older puppy training system if you're in that older puppy phase and you want to turn that older puppy into a champion thank all of you from all of us I'm Charles Miller German Shepherd Man dot com